Alright, what's up, OG Squad? Today we're watching, uh, well, people, you know, this, what well, this type of family, like, have the, a disability that they have no arms, that it is a blessing, they can do everything. And, like, you know, their hope, like, their hopes and dreams are still going, and, you know, they're doing the same thing, they're making goals and accomplish things, nothing is not letting them down, so it's just a blessing, like, as you look at this video, you be thinking like, damn, I can't do that. It's in their flexibility and everything is so amazing. And, and yeah, uh, comment uh, below. See how you think about it. See how you feel about it. Just let me know. Uh, all other videos coming around. So, just letting you know right there. And, let's get it. I'm just like the other kids. Just like them. Linda Bannon and her son Timmy suffer from a rare condition that left them born without arms. Shirt sure, outer in. But despite their circumstances, I can't the mother do and son from Illinois refuse to let their disability stop them from living life to the full. Oh, you can swim. Yo, I can't, I can't even do that. If, if I ain't got no arms, I would be so damn scared. Just to be honest with you, I cannot do that, man. Hey, let's take, let's take a lot of, man. That's, man. That's, that's good. I can't, I can't do that at all. Oh, I, I will panic and drown. I can't, I can't do that. But, you know, it, it's just, it's just a blessing for the people that you know they can do this. That's pretty, that's pretty damn awesome. You can do anything with their legs. Affecting only one in 100,000 people, Linda suffers from Holt Oram syndrome, which also causes heart problems. But that didn't stop 35 year old Linda living a normal life growing up. Being born without arms probably, from my perspective, hasn't really affected my life that much because it never really occurred to me growing up that I was that much different than anybody else. In 2003, Linda met future husband uh. Richard, and when she fell pregnant, doctors made the couple aware that any child could be born with Linda's condition. Going through all the checkups that parents go through when they're expecting a baby. We were given the option to terminate the pregnancy, but it was never even a consideration of ours. We want a family, we want to have a baby. Timmy suffered with severe heart problems when he was born. Oh, At just God. eight days old, he was rushed into surgery and spent the first two months of his life in intensive care. But despite his difficult start in life, Yo, that's like his amazing. Mother, Timmy would not allow his disability to get in the way. Yeah, that's amazing! <laughs> the pair refused to wear prosthetic oh, limbs and insist their conditions have never held them back. Whether it's cooking, getting dressed, or playing video games. Oh, I love this one! While Linda does everything she can to maintain her independence, Richard is always ready to help out. I do have to help in the bathroom. Other than that, the other stuff that I help with, she can do herself. But being that I feel like I'm supposed to be helping her, I do them for her, even though I don't necessarily need to. Okay. Let's move. Let's move out. At school, Timmy is treated like any other student. I'm just like the other kids. Just like them. And I'll be just like them every time of my life. Timmy's personality is such that he gets along with all of his classmates. They accept him for who he is. They play along with each other. I think the kids don't even recognize that Timmy has some special needs. Whoa. And when school's over, Timmy and Linda are often found at the local pool. I keep afloat by like using my butt a little bit. And I go under like on my back or on my front. Along with managing Timmy's busy sports schedule and working as a kindergarten teacher, Linda is also hoping to help other people with the same condition. I've been starting up taking business classes in business management with the hope of starting a nonprofit organization to help families 
of Damn. children that are like myself and my son. Linda knows that Timmy will face a difficult oh future, a but he's hopeful he will learn to live with his condition and have a happy life just like her. My biggest concern for him is just what will happen if he does not find that companionship because with my husband, I have that person that Bro. when my parents have gone from this earth, I have a person that will look after me and help me and do things for me that my parents used to do. Hope that he'll find someone. We'll just have to wait and see. Hugged it. Oh no! Ah! So that's it, guys. Uh, well, that is pretty amazing. And you see that flexibility, everything they do, they never stop. Nothing cannot stop them being successful and everything. Their lives being horrible, they reaching their goals and stuff like that. That's just truly amazing. That I, I was I was scared because I thought the I thought the the little boy gonna drown or, or some, you know, just like a quick panic. But he know how to swim, man. I guess that, that was the second time you were seeing him swimming and stuff. It was not even afraid. I mean, he know how to how to do it. It's just all by legs and feet, and to it like so amazing because like when his mama was holding pi uh, pictures and and cooking and stuff like that, it's like. Like her, like her toes, her toes and stuff was like fingers, and she was grabbing them like this. I mean, that is so amazing, so inspiring, man. This is this is just to show you that the family is, you know, bright. You know, they they love it, man. It don't matter. It seems that work it out. It's all right for them. This is OG Ocean, and I'm out. <laughs> and don't forget.